Well, good news, bad news. Put the overdrive back together. Spun it up. And this time I spun it up just as fast as that little drill would go, which is probably only about 500 RPM. And we were able to get 50 PSI out of it. When I did my overdrive transmission, that same drill gave me full pressure, like 450. So, I blew air down through the uh, intake or the operational valve and all kinds of air blew out past this piston. So I'm thinking we've got a worn out piston. That's where that's at. And my brother finished this patch up. Looks pretty sweet. And we had a little rusty bit back here. You cut that out. Got the patch made for it. Will that in tomorrow. So at least somebody made some progress. <laughs> All right, later guys. Yeah, there's one other thing I was wanting to maybe ask you guys who are watching. This is a early A-type. It's a, a large piston A-type. It's a 1374, I think. And you can't, well, you can't see the large piston spring now because I got that in there holding the piston down, but that spring is six and a half inches long which is what moss sells their large spring this spring is only five and a half inches moss shows their small spring at six and a quarter does anybody out there with a early a type know that their uh, springs were that much difference in size if you do let me know later